Now, the next step that I usually do when I'm packing is put a weight in the back in my uh, where my deployment bag usually goes and then I have a couple other tricks I use just to make sure that uh, everything ends up lining up evenly and so what I do is actually pin my risers together so you can see how perfect that is and then uh, the next step to packing is you want to take your steering lines and your rear riser lines and your front riser lines and just follow them all the way up to the canopy here. Get all the air out here. Alright, and this might be kind of hard to see, but the key to this is getting your line straight. And so what we usually do is turn it a little bit sideways and you're going to find your nose. See these are the, this is the front of the canopy that fills up with air and makes it like a wing, your parachute like a wing. Mine is a seven cell canopy so I count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good way to know you've got them all is your two logos are right there. Then the next thing you want to do is just really give that a good shake away. And then you kind of tuck it between your legs. And then spread the canopy back out here. So I'm hoping that you guys can see what I'm doing here, but there's a good number of these lines that are just stabilizer lines. And so the first thing I want to do is I want to stick my hand down in here. And uh, look for my A lines. So here's my A lines. And then I'm going to flake that out. Okay. And fold that right back down in there. And I'm going to take. So these are A lines, B lines. Flake that. And then finally, because this is such a big parachute, you kind of have to hold some of these lines up here to get your next fold there. But as you can see, I've got A lines, B lines, C lines, D lines all lined up on top of each other. So now I'm going to go ahead and do that on the other side. And then I got to get my So there you have it again, 
separated all nice and evenly. Then the uh, next step we want to do is bring that slider back down and kind of quarter it. And you want it right up against the grommets. And you're going to corner it, quarter it between your sliders right here and then front to back like that. And you want them all the way up against the grommets, these slider things right here, right up against the grommets. And then you want to bring this label. And it's all about keeping your lines tight and keeping your grommets right here under this label. And so what I'll do is I'll kind of tuck this nose in here and then use a leg just to wrap it around. Switch hands. Use a leg, wrap it around there, and then I'm not sure if you can see this, but I'm basically going to line up these lines here, and then give it some nice folds. Then the next step can be kind of hard. Laying down the canopy. Something that I have not yet to master. Because the idea is to keep the line straight. As you set it down. So, you should be able to see how straight those lines are coming back here. And then, uh, one of the many tricks we use in the uh, skydiving industry is getting a piece of carpet and setting it on there to uh, right now I'm just making sure that my pilot chute is all the way cocked And that blue right there tells me that it's that it's fully cocked. And then I like to uh, get my bag ready. So that it's a little bit easier to All right. 